Cool, so we are on our way to Hong Kong airport and from there I'll be flying out to Dubai. This is Jason, he's my roommate. What a great guy to meet. He is also Colombian and um, I have enjoyed his rant so much and he's on his way to Italy. Uh, Jason, what was your experience of the trip? Um, it was a wonderful moment, but uh, when I go home now. You want to go home? Yeah. Uh, what do you think about uh, buying teapots in the China market? Uh, that sucks. <laughs> Everybody has different prices, I don't know. <laughs> and what do you think about Hong Kong's people that um, beat people when they don't give them prices? Oh yeah. <laughs> they talk <popped> now. <laughs> 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 That's why you do online checking versus normal checking. On to Hong Kong Airport, and um, I'm really looking forward because the flight I will be taking is an A380. So it's the first time that I will be flying in the big one. Um, what an adventure it has been! To all the friends I've met, to everybody I had to say goodbye to on this journey. Um, I just want to let you know it won't be the final goodbyes because now I know people all over the world. So uh, I'll definitely be traveling to Russia, Australia, um, the USA, uh, Puerto Rico, Colombia, um, pretty much anywhere I can go. And um, to these friends I would like to say thank you for sharing this awesome journey with me. Um, it's really been great and I really hope that uh, we'll stay in contact for quite a bit after this. Now it's part or it's time for the next big adventure which is Dubai and uh, I think the general summary I can give of Hong Kong is it's a, it's a beautiful city um, and out of all the cities, cities we, we have, man I'm tired, out of all the cities we have visited, um, Hong Kong is by far the one in China that will definitely stay in. It feels very western, it feels very modern, uh, most of the people speak English which is great for us because Wow, Google Translate can only help you that much and in Hong Kong they speak Cantonese, not Mandarin. So there we couldn't use Google Translate at all, but luckily people could speak English. Um, so Hong Kong is a beautiful city. I would, out of all the cities we've visited, definitely stay here. Um, and um, that's my general overview of the city. I can't really think of something else other than the views are just breathtaking. And the skyline at night at the pier is just, it's beautiful. Um, but now I'm going to have a seat, just relax a bit, and then catch the plane out to Dubai. So this is Luan signing out from China. This will be the longest sunset I've ever seen because we are basically chasing the sunset. full row seat open what a massive aircraft and I can't believe that it's so smooth the takeoff uh, the engine sounds everything I mean it's just smooth you, you hardly hear it you hardly notice that uh, you're actually in an airplane um, and the seats are also a bit bigger so having a whole row, row open is like having a bed so I enjoyed the flight thoroughly it was wonderful um, I've met up with Tariq, he's the, the Airbnb host I'll be staying with in Dubai, really such a nice guy, very friendly, um, I look forward to the conversations we'll be having, um, and he's also going to show me around some of the local places here in Dubai as well. The area which I'm staying in is, uh, is pretty much the, um, the tourist attraction for finding good deals. So the gold souks are here, the spy souks are here, the perfume souks are here, so I'm really looking forward to that tomorrow. I'll see what it uh, has in store. The plan is that if I can, I would love to do the Burj tomorrow night uh, during the sunset. Apparently you do need to book the ticket, so, but it is Ramadan, so hopefully um, there are not so many tourists here, and hopefully there will be tickets available, so I'm going to check that now. It's currently half past one Dubai time. Um, so if I relate that back to China time, I need to think is it forwards or backwards, it's forwards. So that means that I should currently be waking up in China, like half an hour. So that's why I feel, I feel actually quite perky and awake. Um, 
man. I never saw jet lag waiting, but it has. No idea what. Because I'm just so cool. <laughs> this one? Uh, this one or that one? Maybe. Ah, yeah. ah.